Hi, welcome to Graphic Island Tutorial. In this video, we'll create a logo which is related to gadget and the mobile shop. So let's create it. The first step, I'll do the page setup. To make a page setup, I need to go to the file, new, and here give the page resolution and click on create. Once you are done with the page setup, the first step here what I'll do is I'll take the text tool from the toolbar and write the logo title that is CHIPS and gadget G-A-D-G-E-T-S and now select the text by pressing shift alt key on your keyboard drag it and make the size bigger so that it would be visible for us after writing the text now we need to choose a perfect font for this logo to select a perfect font you need to go to the character and under character if you know the font name you can simply type it here so here I am using sad films regular you can note down this uh, text name and you can search on the Google and download it this is a free font and I'll select this font now after selection of the font the next step is I will convert this font into an object so that I can do edit to this text so to convert this font into an object what I'll do I'll go to the object and expand it make sure this object and fill is marked and click OK now this text is no longer in font format now this is in object format so we can easily edit the text now after conversion to object what I'll do here is I'll go to uh, toolbar and from here I'll choose this free transform tool so here I'll choose free distort so that I can make this italic to a normal regular font so just simply I'll drag it like this so here I'm making the font is straight after doing this I'll select this text go to object and ungroup it I'll select this and by using right arrow key on the keyboard I'll take it towards right hand side little and this one I'll take at the center after taking center I'll simply just rotate it a little like this now from the toolbar I'll take this rectangular tool and here I'll draw a rectangle I'll remove this fill color of the rectangle from here and select this down stroke option and give the stroke color so I'll select the text again and group it let me unselect this by pressing shift key and now group the text so the reason I'm grouping here so that when I'll select them all so it should align at the center horizontally and vertically with the uh, outer rectangle so that the text should be at the center always now select this rectangle and increase the stroke from here a little after giving some stroke when you will click over this direct selection tool you will find this this dragging point on of on all the four corners of the rectangle so just simply you can drag it like this and make the shape
select this one if you want then you can remove the stroke a little and now go to object and expand it so after expanding uh, this stroke will remain constraint it will not change you can drag it down and make the size smaller now from the toolbar again take this rectangular tool and from here draw a rectangle up to here now select them all and do vertically align center from here and horizontal align center as well so that this one will come at the center now select this one and rotate it after rotation of this select this and now go to object path offset path here give negative offset give minus 20 and preview it let's increase the negative offset up to this much and click ok you can change this new offset now take this pen tool and by following this outer outer part of the rectangle you can draw a straight line like this you can drag it let's change the color for this line so that it it can be visible for us and take this one here up to here and from down also by pressing alt key you can uh, make duplicate of the line simply by dragging and take up to here now select this one and this one and this one using shift key take this shape builder tool by pressing alt key delete this and delete from here now select this one delete it select this one delete it now select this take this direct selection tool once you uh, click over this direct selection tool you'll find those dragging point is arriving from both uh, for all the four corners of the rectangle and you can simply drag it and make the corner round now select this one go to object path offset path here give negative offset again let's give six okay now select this down offset and this one take shape builder tool by pressing alt key delete it select this one and drag it little down using shift alt key now select this go to object path offset path here give positive offset this time let's give 12 okay and select this one using shift key take shape builder tool by pressing alt key just delete it now select this one and this one using shift key do right click on your mouse and arrange send to back 
now take this rectangular tool here draw a rectangle like this now select this one and this shape take shape builder tool using alt key delete it like this now take this rectangle and here draw a rectangle like this and place this one here drag it using alt key and make a duplicate and make a smaller in size now from the toolbar select this pen tool and let's change the color from here and here draw a line like this select this line and from here increase the stroke object expand it okay and unite it now take this direct selection tool and drag this point and now take this ellipse tool by pressing shift alt key here draw a circle at the down also take this pen tool and here also draw a straight line like this select this line give the stroke object expand it okay unite it now take this direct selection tool and drag the points like this take this one at the center now select this one this one this one and this one take shape builder tool by pressing alt key delete it here delete this and delete this one now take pen tool and from here draw a shape like this and from here draw a shape like this now select this this and this using shift key and from here unite it now from the toolbar take this ellipse tool and here draw an ellipse like this let's change the color of the ellipse and give transparency so that we can see the background take this ellipse here and rotate it now from the toolbar select this rectangular tool and here draw a rectangle big rectangle like this now select this rectangle and this ellipse using shift key take shape builder tool and delete this portion now select this one and this and this now take shape builder tool again pressing alt key delete it here and now delete this one send this one to the back now take rectangular tool and here draw a background 
and choose black background here do right click and send this one to the back let's change the color little bit so that other objects will be visible for us and we can change the color select this one choose white color and give that transparency select this one and here we can see this gap is filled up so we need to recreate this gap by using the shape builder tool and using the alt key now select this one and choose white color select this one choose white color and this one we need to ungroup it after ungroup ungrouping uh, we can apply different color here and this one and this one will reduce the opacity and for this one we'll choose different color here also we'll do the ungroup and select those using shift key and then will group it and apply the same color and this one this will again make a group and do the multiple selection using shift key and group it and for this one we'll keep white in color and this one I'll apply the same color here now from the toolbar take this rectangular tool and draw a rectangle from here and select those text take shape builder tool and delete it and however the gap is filled up you need to delete those now select this using shift key take this color picker tool this eyedropper tool and apply this same color so here instead of white we'll apply this black and increase the opacity a little so that it should looks like this okay now I'll select this one and make it black background and here we are done Hope you understand all the steps I did and explained. Wish you all the best. See you in next video. Have a nice day.